always liked cooking since I was eight. My mom raised us with good food. She allowed me in the kitchen and she'd be pretty tough on me. But it tastes good, but no, that's not the right way, you know? So I was always inspired by her. When I was working in the Japanese restaurant when I was 16, I told myself, like, I need to have a restaurant. I know what I'm gonna do. I knew it. Since that day, I started working hard on that. Saving up, saving up to try to learn as much as I can. Peru has these elevations and has all these microclimates and it, the soil is so rich. The Amazon, the mountains, we have all ecosystems, really. All of them. There's a lot to be discovered still. I had some passion fruit growing. Black onion mint, some edible flowers. Most of the other stuff won't grow properly. Try growing the purple corns and it'll grow pink. Giant corn will be small. That's what I chose to import my products, just to make it more authentic. Give the people a chance to actually taste the real stuff. El Lama, we showcase different regions of Peru. Started with dishes that come from the coastside, like with the octopus. And then the ceviche lima. Then we go to the mountain side where the anticuchos were born, the beef hearts. And we show them the smoke in it, because it's really a street food. People, they go like, oh yeah, you're right, you know, like when I had before in a street car, you know, the smoke is hitting your face. And like, yeah, that's a part of the experience. In the jungle, we have, for example, the arapaima, the paiche. It's a huge Amazonian fish, and we cook it exactly the same way that the tribes do. I like to keep the traditional part, but you know, the challenge is just to make it look nice. What I like about being a chef is having the chance to see people go, oh, this is different, you know, this, I never tried this before. I, I'll take whatever chef sends. Trying to make people surround themselves in an experience, in a place, without having to leave, you know, to Peru. With less tables, I have a chance to give more detail. I can see what people's feeling is intimate, cozy. It took a lot of work, and I'm pretty proud of where it is, like in such a short time. I was mostly my mom who challenged me all this time, and I felt accomplished when she came to the restaurant a year and a half ago, and she finally tried the food, and she was pretty impressed, and she liked it. She didn't complain about anything. She didn't tell me nothing. And I felt very accomplished with that. 